What's up everybody? My name is Vince. Welcome to the channel and we're here with the crew from Ohio Power Tool as well as Sarah from Cop Tool. And why are we with them? Because we're at Ohio Power Tool for the Milwaukee. What, wait, what sale is it? It's the tent sale. There it is. The tent sale. The tent sale. And what's going on for the tent sale? We're giving stuff away. We're giving stuff Hot away. Hot deals, lots of batteries. And Sarah, what are you doing here? I don't know. She's checking it out. She doesn't. She, it's an exciting time she, to be here. She loves the deals on Milwaukee Tools. Yeah, that's why I'm here. That's why she's here. We're here for you guys. We saw some amazing demos, and now so are you. Action. So, one out to 750. So this ca this cable cutter will cut what size of cables? So 750 copper, 1,000 aluminum. Okay. And this is actually our 600 MCM crimper. So it can go from crimping to cutting, and this can actually come in the kit. It's actually our 2679-750C kit. Wow. And you can add this on there. So crimp and cut. Crimp and cut. Cut and crimp. So typically, what would we be using to make the cut if we didn't have this powered solution? It's tough. I, I would say either a, a hand application or this is something where it's a kind of a state, a stone age kind of thing. I don't know. I'm trying to think. Like so, a so manual large cutters. And, and the deal is, is that it's the repetitious movements over time that cause ligament damage. It, 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 you know, this is one of those tools. And I, I feel that Milwaukee's looking as the solution to keep electricians, technicians, people in the field longer practicing their profession right doing their profession making more money with less injury i, I think this is pretty cool that that they're out with this this is this is on pre-sale as well or is this already this is for this sale is available this is available cool and strip we could strip so all we got to do right we have our m18 cable stripper you know what's great about this we could we can adjust we have adjustable 11 p.m at night our, our strip so if you're putting lugs on or crimps on, whatever it is, uh, you're able to adjust that strip. Three inches, two inches, one inch, zero inches, anything in between, it's adjustable. This tool also comes in an M12 version. M12 version that'll do up to 500. So up to 500. This'll do up to 1,000, we said, right? What we do said? up to 750. 750, okay. So you're getting more capacity with the M18. This kit comes with a two amp hour yes. battery? Yes. Okay. You know what's great about this is that you would have to use generally a stripping knife. You take your knife and you'd be stripping this cable. Otherwise, you get ununiform stripping. And what happens is, is that you could get a high resistance connection. The other thing is as you're stripping, you could injure yourself. So once again, Milwaukee's found a way to make you more productive and safer on the job site. You make more money. You don't have to go to the emergency room. There's all kinds of benefits. Absolutely. I didn't realize, you know, I've seen so much on this. I feel like I've seen so much on this that I didn't realize it's still on pre-sale. Yes. I think, there's, I think there's a link in the description below yep. if you wanted to get it on pre-sale. I'm not, I'm the not cool sure. thing about it, guys, it actually yeah. comes with capabilities of ordering the aluminum set, the die set, and the copper set as well. So aluminum, you, you could get both, you, or you can get one or the other, or no? You can get one or the other, depending on the different type of model number that you have. Gotcha. Yep. Gotcha. That's it, simple. Wasn't that easy? Joe's busy getting the demo ready. We're super excited because we have a winning combination today. And I'm not talking about me and Joe. I'm talking about Milwaukee's new nine inch battery powered. What is it? Concrete saw. It's concrete. They, they call it the cutoff tool, yep. right? We have it paired, which I, I think it's an awesome combination. Milwaukee's backpack sprayer water solution what do you want to what, what do we call it the powered what, what is it called it's actually called the water switch pack that's why we're a good combination too because i just talk about things joe has all the information the correct names and such so this makes it an awesome solution because we're able to not have to go find a long hose a hose bib 
We have the solution. It's all in one. We're able to water cool our saw. And Joe's going to show how effortlessly and dust free this solution is. Hey, what's going on, guys? We're here at our Power, How Power Tool. My name's Joe. I'm the Milwaukee rep here in Columbus, Ohio. Uh, we're actually demoing our nine inch cutoff saw here today. Um, some quick statistics about it, guys. Not only can this do 80 cuts on 5H rebar, but also 60 cuts through your standard center block. A few things about the weight itself. As you can see, I'm lifting up with just one hand. Compared to our competitors, that weighs over 25 pounds. Ours is under 12 pounds with the battery inside. So it comes in two battery kit and also a bare tool. Um, and it comes with a diamond blade and an abrasive blade. So you're heavy metal. But let's go ahead and make a cut. Absolutely. I think it's pretty amazing that a saw of this size that can cut through these materials, we're talking about cutting through concrete, we're talking about cutting through a rebar. It's something previously you'd need gas power for. Absolutely. And it's done on 18 volt battery power. It's unreal. You see the gasket actually inside, so you compared to like all the water and material and different sparks that are flying through the air, this gas is actually gonna defer all the What's the rating on that gasket? Wow, that's pretty cool. Is that a 56, 65? What is that? You know? It's a pretty good gasket. Look at it. So we are running a 12 amp hour battery on here, guys, and that's gonna be what's coming in the kit. So your 12, 12, two 12 O's. Two 12 O's. What's, what's the cost of the saw, the two batteries, and the charger in the kit? Yep, so bare tool 599, kit 899. Cool. I think it's still on pre-sale here. If it is, we'll have a link down below. I'm not sure, we'll see. If it's not there, you know, don't be mad at me. You know what's great about this saw is that it's powerful, right? Another good thing about it is it's pretty relatively lightweight and compact. Yeah. But with lightweight and compactness, that means it could just walk away on its own. Absolutely. I see that as is one key. Yeah. So it allows us to what? Inventory the tool. What other settings come along with, with the one key? Is there Anything I'm trackability too as well. So let's say you're a procurement manager and you're worried about some different higher price tools that are on the job site, worried about walk, walking off. So this one in particular, it has our one key capability built inside. So you can connect to this tool, you can inventory it, and you can also track it. So let's say you're on a big job site, you can set that geofence around that job site. And if it walks off, it'll send you that notification that it's now off the job site and you can go find for it. Wow. Let me ask a question. You could set that geofence. Once it passes the geofence, does it disable the tool? Or do you have to manually disable it? So you manually disable as soon as it leaves that geofence, it actually tool locks it, so it makes it essentially a demo tool. So it will yes. tool lock once it yep. passes the geofence. Absolutely. That's awesome. Somebody's gonna steal my stuff. I, I don't want them to be able to use it. <laughs> you know, I want them to come back and go, yo, Vince, this thing's broke. I didn't need to steal this. Here, take this back. That would be pretty awesome. So it's gonna be a pretty light paperweight. Yep. You should put like a little, like a note inside. If this tool's not operating and you've stolen this, you could bring it back, I will not have you arrested. Let me ask you, replacement blades, they're just a standard, they're just a nine inch standard replacement blade, correct? It could be any, is, so just, you know, they're not Milwaukee specific, are they? So we make our own blades. So yes. you do yeah, make your own. We provide our own diamond and abrasive blade. Yes. Uh, you can purchase those two on the side, but um, you know, obviously we are capable of the same arbor um, that our other nine inch saws are gotcha. capable of. So it's universal. So if you're, if you're somewhere and you can't get your hands on those Milwaukee specific wheels, blades, and you don't have to worry about being out of luck. It's not a proprietary thing. You could use a standard nine inch blade. Pretty cool. So you want to put the tool lock feature on there? Do you want to like talk about I mean, that? yeah, that would be fine. I, I know I know we want to we kind of activate it and then you we want to focus on uh, on one key especially. Like it'll, it'll so so you're telling me like so where's the geo like where would be the geo fence? So now it's done. Now it's done. Now it's locked out. And if anybody walk past the geo fence it's automatically going to do this and then it'll alert you. So as soon as it connects with 
think of like a brotherhood. Think of one key like a brotherhood because as long as there's there's over six million downloads across the United States currently. So as soon as this tool connects with someone like you that has it dormant in their phone, it automatically relays your data that locks it out and syncs it. So therefore, as soon as it leaves and connects with any other person that has this app, it'll automatically shut off. It's locked up. And this won't activate until I actually either A, reconnect with the tool or unlock it myself manually. So I'm gonna go ahead and unlock it. I mean, you can, see, you can see the battery's fully charged. It just will not run. So it'll connect three times and now it's ready to go. We're ready to get back to work. Look at that. Yep, I unlocked it. I can tell you, it gets up to speed pretty quick. Yo, that was an awesome, awesome demonstration. I love it. And I appreciate it, Joe. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Yo, you do the best kind. And if you like the best kind of demonstration, smash the like button, get subscribed and tap the bell because we don't come out to Ohio Power Tool often, but when we do, you're not gonna wanna miss it. See you on the next one, everybody. What kind of water does it take? Anything? I was, it was a joke. <laughs> uh, filtered water, yes. Spring water. Does it take distilled? Does the, does the water we use to cool the blade, does it have to be, could it be still or sparkling? Oh my God, those demos were amazing. I hope you enjoyed them as much as I did. With that, I wanna say I appreciate everybody being here for the awesome demos and demonstrations and hanging out with me. We appreciate you stopping by. Well, thank you, I appreciate your line. We'll see you all on the next one.